I just woke up and I got finished. I just got finished meditating and doing some morning journaling and now I am going to go back to sleep for two more minutes until I have to get up and do my Sunday to-do list. So I see y'all when I get up and I feel a little bit more energized. It is 1.16, I'm up. <laughs> And I feel re-energized. This is what I get for staying up at 4. I don't know how long I was up last night. Probably till like 4. Yes, 4. I was up till 4 reading this yaoi that Alyssa, Alyssa Art, like, recommended to me. And that shit was like super freaking good. Like, I had to finish it. I can't wait for the next episode, but now I'm getting up. I'm finna do my to-do list, which is gonna be over there. Gonna be over there in that desk and get shit done. But first, I need to take a shower, I need to wash, and all that. Because if you don't do that, if you're not going through a rough time, you're nasty. And they know who I'm talking to. The ones who don't wash their legs, you know exactly who I'm talking to. A little bit, a little bit more presentable. Zoner. Yes, I do. Okay, anyway. So, I did all the shit that normal human beings are supposed to do, which is wash, wash your face, all that. So, now I'm going downstairs to finish my full moon ritual, which, because I burned some things and my mind or my spirit guides are telling me to throw it in our garden, which we don't really have a garden. It's basically our backyard. We have like a front thing, but that's not really whatever. We're going to call it a garden. And I think I'm gonna do it in front, but I also have to get my crystals because they were out last night charging up. And like I had them out in the sun for so long and some of those crystals ain't supposed to be out in the sun, so I need to go and get them right now. So let's go to the dark hallway. And don't mind this match sucks. to dump these beautiful babies here and released what I need to release. It feels me. But that's the only time I'm gonna ever release it here. I'm just doing it now because that's what my spirit guys told me to do, so I'm gonna do it. Cause they never steer me wrong. You feel me? Oh my god guys look at the freaking I don't know what you call them. I'm going for daffodils. But yes, now I'm going to put my crystals away. So let's do that. So this is my full moon water. Um, if it'll focus, but yes. It got a little bit of sunshine in it too, so power. And this is all the crystals and they're chilling. I can't wait for the dreams I have tonight with this baby because every time I charge it, focus, focus, focus. It's not gonna focus, whatever. But every time I, oh, there you go. Every time I charge this baby, it gives me hella good dreams, vivid dreams that I can remember. So, I'm ready. So I just wrote out everything I need to do on my planner, which just looks 
but I basically have to work out and today is cardio it's cardio I don't I can't skip it I've been skipping it for months months literally months my cardio days I've been skipping it for months so I have to do it so I'm gonna have to get on it and I do that around five so now I just have to clean room which the room is already clean because I had to clean it yesterday for the Scorpio full moon you know your area needs to be clean before you do any type of ritual to get the energy flowing so you do that and by the way if you're like spiritual and you did a ritual for the Scorpio full moon let me know that but no I can't speak if you did something for the Scorpio full moon, let me know down below because I would like to know what you did for your rituals because what I did was do some tarot, I journal, I released a lot of stuff and I put it on a piece of paper, burnt it and put it in my glass bowl that I imbued with protection and just kept burning it and it felt so good. And that was the first time I ever like started to burn shit. So. I can't wait to do even more rituals like that. I like burning shit. It's just so, it just released so much energy. Like, I was always scared to do it before, which is why I had like kept the candles and stuff. But girl, we burning shit. Okay. Um, and I also have to take some of these prints down because I want some new ones. Put up some new ones. Probably put up like stuff that I like to use. Probably put up like my own like prints and shit. But yeah. Um. And then I, did I tell you about the package orders and like plan out my week? If not, I'm saying it now. So you guys are going to see me do that, especially packaging orders. I'm going to show you guys how I go through that. And the new thank you cards I got, I did not show you guys yet, but they look so bomb. They look so good. So let's get into that shit. Oh, this is my agenda. I had this since last year. Oh, come on, like. Had it since last year and this is how i get my sunday together i always start out by planning everything i need to do on a sunday so that is what i am going to do if you don't have a planner get yourself together not playing so, let's freaking do it like, it's so fun to write a planner even if you don't even finish all this shit it's so fun to write it and have like all your thoughts in one place you know? Get this shit popping. You see how easy it was to plan out my week? Super freaking easy. Um, I basically do the same thing every single week, which is probably why it's so easy for me to plan it out. You know? Because I'm just basically doing what I do every single week. It's like, do my Patreon, post YouTube, work on my site, research, um, plan out my week and my month, and, you know, make bank. Make some coins. So, yeah, that's basically what my everyday average week looks like. Um, and I tried out this new method, which is to just do three things every single day or like uh, two to three things every single day. So you won't overwhelm yourself because I these past couple of months, I've been very, very overwhelmed and I would never finish what I had on my plate for that day. So I noticed that just having three basic things definitely helped me out like. A lot so if you have problems with like trying to uh, you know complete shit do that do three things only every day like three things that pertains to your business or something productive that you really need to do and you haven't done that way you will get a lot more done quicker um, workout don't count workout is mandatory so that's there so this is like the three things I do and every time you cross it out you feel so much better because you're like, okay, damn, I only got one more thing to do and then I can chill. That's that's how you trick your mind. I love tricking my mind. It's so fun. But uh, yeah, so that's me planning out my week. So now I'm going to package orders and I'm going to show you what I use to package my orders. So let's get in this box area right here. I also use this beige paper here. To give it a little bit more like a 
character. So, ooh, don't put this on the screen. So, I'm going to put that there. But now I'm just going to go in here and get the thank you cards and business cards. Um, so, yeah, these are my new thank you and business cards. Um, they match with my aesthetic now. And I had to get new ones. So, that was the old one. It was when I was like white and then I changed it because I'm a Levi and indecisive. And I always change it. But uh yeah, so this is my thank you card, my um business card now. I really like what I put on for the design. And then this is my thank you cards now. So and I got these both from Vista Print. They always have sales, like good deals. And see they're glossy. Like all my work. They always have good sales or like their thank you cards and business cards and anything else you ever want in your life. They have like really good sales on it. So, you know, I got those, which I don't know how many I'm gonna have to get out here yet, but I'm just showing you guys. And I also have my weight machine. If you ever package orders, you need this because you want to know the exact amount. Okay, but <laughs> you need to know the exact amount. And then I have like this do not bend tape because they act like they don't understand. Like when you see like a flat ridge, maybe they're not to bend it, but you know, you gotta let them know. It's fragile. And then um, these are where I place my stickers, which is what I'm gonna be packaging today. And then I have my envelopes for the stickers. I have this cute thank you roll. I have some ribbon. I have stamps. I have some old business cards in here. And then I have like washi tape I need to use to like package them up. You know, yeah, these two draws, nothing. But these three draws here is what I use to package my prints. So let me just get what I need for it. And so I am back. I hate the horrible lighting I have, but so I have the envelopes I need, the stickers right there, the thank you cards, some washi tape, the business cards, the thank you notes, the ribbons, this, and my beige paper. And I'm going to put this all together to create an experience for whoever supports me. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for supporting me. Like without you guys, I would not be to continue doing what i love so if you do like like anything you see here they're all still on my site i still have eight more of the 12 zodiac sticker sets and i have like a lot of their separate stickers um so you guys can get that and i also have like prints originals print bundles t-shirts which i forgot to say on here but yeah i have a mora t-shirt that's on there right now and it's available to purchase and i also have some iphone cases of the zodiac series as well so yeah head over to my shop which will be linked down below Ooh, 111 i just saw that come on angel spirit guides but yeah if you want anything you see off my site and would like to own this like cute little card which you can keep five ever because you know it's like a free little print piece like a free little piece with the gloss that looks exactly like how i create my prints just go down to the link in the description box so yeah let's get into it I just finished packaging orders which really didn't even take that long um i'm gonna save this here for now just because i get any more orders in and you know i have to 
package those two. Um, but now since I, I honestly basically just checked everything off of my to-do list that I had to do today. So I am going to chill out until I have to, the only thing I probably would have to do again is if like any more orders came in, I would just have to package those orders so they can be shipped out for Monday. But other than that, I'm done for today. So I am going to go watch some anime, make some food because I'm fucking hungry. I did not eat at all. Like, what is it? It's gonna be three o'clock? I still haven't ate. So I'm gonna go do that and chill. And if I have anything else for you, I'm coming back to you. <laughs> Bye, guys.